Hey family, I'm back with another fitness video. So now off late I've been getting questions from all of you that Tarun, you're looking very beefed up. You know, you've packed on a considerable amount of muscle mass. And you know, on some of my Instagram posts, you know, if you can see somewhere here, you know, people have been commenting, hey, are you juiced up? Are you with cycle? Are you on? So guys, let me just tell you something. What you see is what you bloody get. If I'm on juice, I will tell you which cycle am I on. I will also friggin tell you where did I buy it from, but I'm not. I've told you in the past, I've tried it, you know, probably made some gains, but I could not keep up with those gains. So this time around, I'm doing it all natural and you know, I'm going to ensure that I keep this gains for as long as I can, plus continue to make these gains. So having said that, so what have I been doing? to make those gains you know if you've been following me if you've seen some of my previous videos i was just about okay and you know in the last couple of three to four weeks i've put on about good seven to eight kilo kilos of uh, muscle mass so i'm going to share in this video what have i been doing and what you can do to get this muscle mass guys so if you can see it's all hardness you know i don't believe in you know bloating myself up and you know just probably looking like a moon face and wondering what the hell's going on here so first thing guys, first thing, when it, the classic rule that I want to share with you and you know, I, there's a big shout out to uh, two of my uh, you know followers I met today called uh, Akshay and Ankur and you know, they made me, so guys shout out to you. So they made me realize something and you know, this is something I thought I should share it with you, you know, why everybody in India or rather everywhere is obsessed with six packs. Now when it comes to adding muscle mass guys, you have to forget about six packs. You have to forget about a uh, little bit of fat gain that you're going to get. What I've seen and what mistakes I've made is the fact that every time I've tried to pack on muscles and my, I, I see my body fat percentage going a little up, instead of cutting down some certain food items which were not suiting me, I would just go back again to cutting. You know, oh, I should just, I can't do this. I should not do it, guys. So this is something that I would not encourage you to do it. If you want to pack on muscle mass, guys, go all out at it and you will uh, uh, be able to pack on muscle mass it's it's as easy as you can make it to be and as tough as you would want it to make it to be again so let's start what did i do and what i've been doing and what i plan to do starting with my uh, food i still eat clean you know whatever it is you know if you, if you remember my transformation you know i had cut out you know, a bit of carbs from there a bit of fino fats from there i've added pretty much everything i eat everything now but I still eat clean, but I eat more. I eat, I eat, I eat because I know for a fact that the moment I get onto a, a stage where I'm very comfortable, when I think, you know what, I've gained a good amount of muscle mass. Now for me, I need to get rid of some water weight. I can go back and create some calorie deficit and boom, it's easy. But kids, teenagers, guys make this mistake that, you know, they just obsess with, you know, those minimized body fat, six pack ass, but you guys, if you don't have muscles, what are you trying to cut? So you have to pack on muscle in your bulking phase. Bulking phase is clean bulk, which is exactly what I'm sharing with you. Eat clean, eat more, train less. You can't be training like a monkey every day, going in the morning, going in the evening, six days a week, five days a week, socializing. No train three days a week one body part bigger body part so th i'll tell you what i'm training so one day i do chest one day i do legs and one, I, one day i do shoulders and arms that's my routine like guys and the next the following days i do shoulders and you know I, I just keep switching things around and i do a lot of compound exercises like deadlifts and you know bench press all these things so guys that is exactly what my point to you is you don't have to do uh, you know, these crazy high intensity workouts, you just have one workout and give everything to it. Now, there's another thing guys about my supplements. So obviously I have been taking supplements. I'm going to share my supplements with you. I'm obviously taking my whey protein. I'm taking about three to four scoops, you know, uh, uh, one, two after my workout. And obviously, you know, uh, two during my day. I'm also taking carb, you know, which is, you know, Carbo Max that I shared with you in my couple of videos back. Now that's the meal, that complex carb meal, which helps me before my workout to give me that insane energy and pump. And after that, plus I'm taking my multivitamin. I'm, I'm in my 30s, so I'm also taking, you know, some test boosters, which includes test uh, Tentex, which is available at the chemist for about 100 rupees. Anybody can try it out. 
I'm also uh, taking BCAAs because whatever gains I want to make, I want to ensure I retain those gains. So these are the only things that I'm doing, guys. And stop commenting on these things. Oh, he's juiced up. Is this and that. if I am, I'll tell you guys. So this is how easy it is. Eat clean, train less, eat more. I hope, I hope this thing gets into your head loud and clear. And uh, you try to imbibe these things into your bulking program. Any one of you have any questions? Feel free to reach out to me. I would encourage you to go to my discussion forum, tarangilfitness.com slash discussion. Or you can also reach out to me either on my Instagram, Facebook or YouTube. And I'll be very happy to help you with your bulking goal. So until we meet again, peace.